Good morning students. Welcome to GK class. Today we will do chapter 7 super nicknames. What fun to make a sobriquet for a friend. Sobriquet, what are sobriquets? Sobriquets are nicknames given to well-known people and places. Do you know that Beijing in China is called the city of cycles. Now let's start the exercise. Read the given sobriquets and write the names of the countries. So, the sobriquets are given to you. You have to write the name of the country. Okay? Let's start. Now, here comes the first picture. Look at this picture. This place is called as Forbidden City. Now think its name. So, this is Lhasa Tibet. Do you know why it is called as Forbidden City? Because the whole city was flogged with numerous monasteries and temples. That's why it is called as Forbidden City. Number second, land of golden pagoda. Okay, now see this picture. Which place is this? Think. And the answer is Myanmar. So Myanmar is called as the land of pagodas. So pagoda. What are pagodas? Pagodas are Hindu or Buddhist temple. Many Myanmar royal families they donated gold to pagodas to build for worship. So that is why it is called as a land of golden pagodas. Now look at the picture. Which place is this? This is also known as Hermit Kingdom. The answer is Korea. Korea is also known as Hermit Kingdom. Do you know what is the meaning of Hermit? Hermit means a person living in solitude as a religious discipline. And Hermit Kingdom is a term applied to any country organization which willfully walls itself from the rest of the world. So it is called as Hermit Kingdom. Now next comes the easy one which country is known as the land of rising sun very easy yes the answer is japan japan is also called as the land of rising sun because the country is so close to where the sun rises now the last one Which country is known as land of white elephants? Very simple. Yes, Thailand is called as the land of white elephants as it has a large number of white elephants and the white elephants are the symbol of royal power in Thailand. Thank you students for listening. Now note the answers in your books.